Hola, Senor Marcus. I greet you in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Hi. So today is the 27th of October. Um, to, today's me. Today's message is going to be on Bible scriptures on husband, wife, sleep, and job. But before I do that, I want to make a little an announcement on this channel. Um, I've just received um, this um, tablet. What gets rid of you know if you have sickness in your body, if you've had like witchcraft or spiritual or anything you know sick anything like anything wicked what's been done of you so i got this um special um tablet here zulu um bitter crystal tablet so this i got this from etsy for i think it was about i think it was about 50 pounds or 100 pounds i got this and it just takes out all the um sickness in the body and stuff like that so it gets rid of worms bugs parasites and snakes so this is really good if you if you've had like witchcraft on you or you've had sickness in your body or anything like that you can get this from etsy so it's quite expensive but if you want to have you know deliverance this is where you should go so i'll put that in the description box where you can get this in etsy so i'll put that in the description box the second announcement is i'm gonna release my ep on youtube on monday the last day of this month of October so that's on next Monday which is the last day of this month and it's one song is called um, his his in his eyes the second song is um, he sees the best in me and the other two are two covers but so it was like backstreet boys I want it that way and on my knees by Janice um, something I can't remember her name she's a gospel singer there but I covered her song so those that that album that EP will be released on Monday so it's two original songs I wrote and two covers so yeah so I just want to get the announcements out of the way so let's get into the itty gritty right the first scripture I'm going to give you today from the word of God is sleep because obviously a lot of us have struggled to sleep when we're you know tired so I found this scripture in from the word of God from Jesus this is King James Bible um, which is the best Bible I, in my opinion so it's let me go to it now it's I think it's Psalms hang on okay it's Psalms 127 and it reads Accept the Lord to build the house that labour in vain, that built it, except the Lord keeps the city of the watchman awake. But it's vain for you to rise up early and to sit up late at night to eat bread of sorrow, for he gives his beloved sleep. Lo, the children of the heritage of the Lord are the fruit of his, his reward, and narrow as the hands of the mighty man and the children of the youth. Happy is the man that has his quivers full of them that shall not be ashamed, but they shall speak with the enemy at the gates. And that is for sleep. That is Psalms 127. So anyone who needs that scripture that's the first one for the word of God right we've got the second one so now if anyone is looking for a, a wife or a husband I've got a scripture for you for that as well let me just get it now I'm getting all the scriptures ready for you now all right here we go where, where was it now where was it oh yes same page so it's Psalms 128 and it reads Bless everyone that fears the Lord, that walks in his ways, for he shall give the, eat the labour of thy hands. Happy shall he be, shall be with thee. The wife shall be a fruitful vine by the side of the house. The children like an olive planted around the table. Behold, the dust search the Lord that be blessed, that fears the Lord. The Lord shall bless thee out of Zion, and they shall see the good of Jerusalem all the days of thee's life. They shall see the children's children and peace upon Israel. And that's Psalms 128. So that's two scriptures at sleep and wife and that can also be for husband as well so it's, it's just what i what i would suggest for anyone who's got these scriptures now just to believe and have faith that god can do it just be specific of how what what kind of husband and what kind of wife you would want and and give your description on your partner what partner you would want and just believe and have faith in these scriptures so that's 128 or Psalms 
127 for sleep and 128 for husband and wife. So I'm going to go for another one now. So this one is, give me a second. Okay, let me get this one. Okay. Scripture for job. Okay, job. Ah, all right, here we go. This is not, this is a good one. So, hang on. So it's Psalms 62 and it reads, and it's verse, 20, verse 12 and it reads, Also unto thee, O Lord, belongs mercy for the render to every man according to his work. So that's Psalms um, 62 and it's verse 12. And that is, let me just read it again. So that's Psalm um, 62, verse 12, and it reads, Also, the Lord belongs mercy for the render every man according to his work. And that is for Job. So, like I said with the other two scriptures, just believe and have faith. Be specific what kind of job you want, you want, and tell the Lord and have faith and believe in the scriptures and that he can do all and all. So those are the two, those are the, those are the scriptures. So um, also, I'm going to give you scriptures on money blessing and healing. So I'm going to go to that right now because I know a lot of people on Facebook has been asking about money blessing, healing, and such and such, healing. And okay, right, so that is, let me go, this is the last time I'm doing this scripture on money blessings because I'm sick of people asking me about oh, money blessing. That's all right. all right, so this is... Psalms, okay, all right, it's 100, Psalms 104, and it's verse 24, and it reads, O Lord, how magnified the works of wisdom has made them all of the earth full of his riches. So like I said with the other previous scriptures, just have belief and have faith that God can do, provide for you and your family with this scripture just believe and have faith and then god can provide for you so um, this is the last time i'm doing money blessing scriptures so that is psalms 104 verse 24 okay right so the next one is for a scripture for people who want healing in the healing in their body or deliverance or whatever this is the scripture for you as well okay it's psalms i think you hang on all right Okay, it's Psalms 141, and it reads, Blessed is he that considers the poor, and loves to live in times of trouble. The Lord will preserve him and keep him alive, and he shall be blessed upon the earth, and those shall not deliver him unto the will of his enemies. But the Lord will strengthen him upon the bed of lashing, those shall make all his bed in sickness. So, that is Psalms 41, verse 1 to 3. And that's it, just believe and have faith, like I said. So that's it for scriptures. I gave you a money blessing. I've gave you a scripture on healing. I've gave you a scriptures on husband and wife and job. So please do not ask me any more. Please, I don't want to hear anyone friending me on Facebook and saying, "Oh, we need this scripture." I've gave them all to you now. You've got them, and I'm going to also put this in the description box for each of them, so you don't have to keep. I have to keep repeating myself regarding this. So. The next thing I am going to do for November, in the middle of November, I am going to show you the the power of communion. So really I'm going to show you how to take communion and what is the what you would need to do in order to drink from the Lord and eat from the body of Christ and to keep your sins at bay. So that will be in November. So I'll make an announcement on my Facebook page and I will tell you when I'm gonna go live with that so I'll make an announcement middle of November sometime middle and then go live with um, the scriptures on that okay so shalom for now God bless you Mwah.